it everyone welcome back to our channel in this week's video we show you guys exactly why we love the Durban beach rent please let us know in the comments down below what your favorite part of the Durban beach rent is if you enjoy our content please don't forget to subscribe so here it is our little piece of paradise Durban is located on the east coast of South Africa looking out upon the Indian Ocean the beachfront is a water sport lover's paradise and a hotspot that all the locals love. It offers a wide range of outdoor activities such as surfing, cycling, kayaking and many more, as well as a wide range of restaurants dotted along its length. It is a prime spot for exercise as the promenade spans over 8 kilometers from one end to the other. Join us as we explore this hidden gem and appreciate everything that it has to offer. So one of our favorite things to do on the beach is to go cycling. We're about to rent two bikes from Expressions and go for a ride. Expression on the beach is a gnarly surf shop set up a stone's throw away from the sand. They specialize in stand-up paddle boarding and surfing, as well as offering lessons for anyone and everyone interested in picking up the sports. They offer subboards, bicycles, go-karts, surfboards and skateboards for hire. Their friendly staff are passionate about what they do and are always willing to lend a helping hand in making your beachfront experience the best it can be. We rented two bikes from here for an hour for 120 Rand and loved every moment. So we took this footage last year when they finished the promenade extension. We've been looking for a way to get it into our YouTube videos since then and thought that this was the perfect opportunity. Now we just need to think of a way to get you guys back into the video. Our beautiful city's beachfront promenade just got a major upgrade in the form of a 750 meter extension. Durban now has the longest beachfront promenade in sub-Saharan Africa. The new extension allows you to walk, jog or ride from the harbour mouth all the way to Blue Lagoon. While filming, we witnessed something pretty special. Every year from May through June, billions of sardines travel along the coastline in the sardine run of southern Africa. This year they've had one of the best seasons yet. It's August and they are still managing to pull out sardines. Their sheer numbers create a feeding frenzy along the coastline. Fishermen gather in large numbers along the shore and throw out their nets pulling in thousands of sardines at a time. So we just had a lovely relaxing cycle on the beachfront and we're now going to go have a drink at our favourite cafe with a beautiful view of the ocean. Circus Circus is a picturesque restaurant and cafe situated on the promenade with a beautiful view of the sea. They offer a wide variety of meals such as salads, steaks, seafood, pastas and curries to name a few of the choices on the menu. Or, if you prefer, pop in for a perfectly brewed cup of coffee prepared with love by one of their baristas. Circus Circus has a wonderful, easygoing atmosphere where you can sit back, relax and enjoy the sea breeze while savouring a delicious meal or coffee. We ordered the yellow juice and a banana and peanut butter smoothie for 91 Rand. Be sure to stop by and check out this beachy cafe. Now that we're feeling nice and refreshed after our lovely drinks, we're off to do one of our favourite activities on the beachfront. Ocean Ventures has a laid-back beachy vibe that just makes you want to hit the waves running. 
They offer kayaks, surfboards, bicycles, go-karts as well as other beach equipment for hire. Their friendly staff make your experience a really pleasant one. We rented two SUP boards from them for an hour for 300 grand. We will definitely be renting from them again soon. We just had the most beautiful supping session. And I was the only chum that fell in the water. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty incredible though that it's literally midwinter and it's still warm enough in Durban to come to the beach and even swim if you want to. But we are feeling a little bit chilly and hungry now and we've got just the thing to fix that. So we can't tell you everything about the Durban beachfront without showing you a little bit of traditional Durban cuisine. We've just stopped off at a restaurant and we're going to try a dish called a bunny chow. Now we both really struggle with hot food, but we're willing to do this for you guys. <laughs> a bunny chow is a South African fast food dish consisting of a hollowed out loaf of white bread filled with curry. It ultimately originated among Indian South Africans of Durban. The precise origins of the food are disputed, although its creation has been dated back to the 1940s. Very yum, but wow, <laughs> the burn just doesn't stop. <laughs> Bilal Cuisine is an Indian fast food restaurant that serves traditional Indian meals as well as a wide range of other meals and drinks on the menu. The atmosphere they have created in this wonderful restaurant makes you feel like you've been transported to Little India. We ordered a quarter mutton bunny chow to share for 70 rand. It was packed with curry, meat and potatoes, and well worth the money. Although we struggle with spicy foods, we really enjoyed our tasty bunny chow. Whew, our mouths are still burning from that bunny chow and we're on the hunt for something to cure that burn. And there's only one place that can really do the job properly. This place is a couple of kilometers away from the beach, but we really feel that it deserves an honorable mention. Welcome to Paul's homemade ice cream. This trendy ice cream parlor was started by none other than a South African guy named Paul who makes ridiculously delicious ice cream. Paul's homemade ice cream is South Africa's first super premium ice cream made with decadent homemade ingredients turned into extraordinary flavor combinations. Their flavors range from birthday cake to cereal milk. If you're an ice cream lover or not, and still need to be convinced, you definitely need to check this place out. We bought two delicious single scoop cones for 53 Rand. So that's it for this week. Thank you so much for watching our video. We absolutely loved our time down at the beachfront, as we always do. That was just a little snippet of what you can do down here at the beach, but we highly suggest that you come down here and experience it for yourself sometime. Don't forget to smash that like button, leave us some love in the comments, and as always, hit that subscribe button. We'll see you guys back again next week Friday. Mm.